The American Heart Association says atrial fibrillation, or AFib, is an irregular heartbeat that affects about 2.7 million people. Those who suffer from this condition often say it feels like their heart quivers or flutters. It's the most common heart rhythm disorder in people over 65, but doctors say many people who have it don't realize how serious it can be. Cardiologists explain AFib as a heart condition that causes the heart's upper chambers to beat too fast and the lower chambers to pump blood abnormally and ineffectively. Doctors say if left untreated, your risk of heart-related death doubles and it also increases your chances of stroke. It also causes chronic fatigue, heart palpitations, shortness of breath, fainting, and lack of energy. Consult a doctor immediately if you believe you have any of these symptoms. To diagnose AFib, your doctor will likely prescribe various tests, including an EKG. Once diagnosed, the goal of treatment is to restore normal rhythm, reduce heart rate, prevent blood clots, manage risk factors of stroke and heart problems. Doctors say there are several different types of treatment, including oral medications and a non-surgical procedure called electrocardioversion. With this procedure, the patient is given an electrical shock to reset the heart to a normal rhythm. When that doesn't work, cardiologists often turn to ablation. With ablation, the cardiologist identifies the part of the heart that is sending a regular electrical activity. Once identified through electrical mapping, the doctor destroys the tissue, often using a laser to burn it. This area scars and blocks irregular signals returning the heart back to normal. Other patients require a pacemaker, which is a small surgically implanted device that artificially regulates the heartbeat. Another surgery to treat AFib is the maze procedure. Here, the surgeon cuts the upper parts of the heart and then stitches it together, again to create scar tissue and eliminate irregular signals. Ask your doctor what method of treatment is right for you. Thank you.